Well, howdy and good morning from Houston, Texas again. This is Scott with Houston Event Photography. This is going to be lesson two of how to set up Darkroom Core and Pro. And where we left off last time, we left off right here in the setup tab. But I'm going to jump back to the photo library tab for a second just to show you. Uh, this is the event that we created in lesson one. It was the date and the name of the customer. We added some photos by importing them in. Um, and I'm going to show you some other things you can do in here. I could remove this catalog completely. I could publish this catalog, which would publish it, I think, to Photo Reflect. Uh, I can add photos. I can quick archive it, or I can archive it too. I'm going to kind of show you all that feature. When I get through with the job, at the end of the day, I come home and I put everything on my server. So I would go to my server here and I'd have master jobs and then I'd put it in the job here and scroll down to where I want it. I'd make a new photo. I mean a new catalog in my server. I'm just going to call this test for darkroom. and hit OK. And it's going to transfer those images really quickly over to my server. So now I have those saved. And it's going to ask you, do you want to remove the catalogs that were just archived from here? And it says you can re restore those later. I always just say keep for right now because I maybe have to go back in here and do some emailing or somebody didn't get their photo or something like that but that's how you would do it so now if i go back in here and i want to um, archive again and i go down to that test for darkroom it said it was previously archived i want to do it again i'm just going to say no but i was just showing you that you can do it over and over and over again it'll just overwrite the one that you have in there or you can make a new folder so we're going to go in here and there's just some other options over here that you can pick from. I don't use this a lot other than for archiving my pictures. Uh, I guess, let me see what catalog info would bring back up your catalogs info. And here is um, where you can change what type of job it is. You got different ones in there. Like I said, mine are all events or corporate. So I could add a different name there, but I'm not gonna really mess with that. I just wanted to show y'all in this video, this catalog and how you archive your photos. And in the next video, we'll get into some of the setup uh, menu items here so that I can show y'all those things, things that are important to be changed. So we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Again, Scott with Houston Event Photography. We're a corporate event photographer based in Houston, Texas that have served this area for over four decades. Thanks for watching again.